I'm going to go ahead and come to my desktop here. And so I'm just running Ignition uh, on my local laptop here, working from home, like many of you, I'm sure. And, you know, I have Ignition installed, like I said, I'm just running at local host. And uh, what I've installed here is RC3 of 8.1. And so uh, if you haven't had a chance to play with this, where you can get this is just on our website. Uh, in the top right, you can go ahead and go to downloads and uh, right at the top, there's a little banner that says, looking for trying the new 8.1, you know, download it here. So I uh, highly recommend you check it out. But uh, when you install it, it looks pretty similar to Ignition 8. Still has home status and config, but right here on the home page, the layout's a little different because uh, we've added uh, right here, the ability to download Perspective Workstation. And uh, it's the same as if you download the Vision Client Launcher or uh, the Designer Launcher. Uh, you can still get to your normal Perspective screens to launch in a browser uh, down below. And uh, on this gateway, I have two projects. Um, one is the sample Quick Start project that uh, is a new feature of 8.1. When you do a fresh install of Ignition 8.1, uh, it will prompt you whether or not you want to install in quick start mode. And if you do install in quick start mode, it will uh, have a, a built-in uh, SQLite database uh, for you. It'll have a, a connection to a simulated device and it will have this pre-built project for you. Uh, certainly feel free to check that out. And I also created a special project today called Workstation Demo that I'll be using to highlight some of the features of Workstation. To kind of get into this, if you're on that home page. You know, and I go and I download Perspective Workstation, then it's going to have a little, you know, application that comes like this and it looks like this. So if I go ahead and click that, you'll be able to see the Perspective Workstation launcher. And uh, before I get too deep into this, I, I, for those of you who may not be familiar with Workstation, if I go and uh, launch Perspective, um, and just launch one of these projects. You can see it just opened a new tab. I'm running directly within my web browser. And uh, when this comes up here, I can uh, navigate around, you know, perspective is just this, you know, modern tool that you can build any kind of screens you want. And if you wanted to see more of this uh, project in action, we certainly have our uh, other resources online, like the community lives we do, community lives we do, uh, where you could come and see uh, a bigger demo of this project. But yeah, this is perspective. Runs in a browser and uh, you know gives you the ability to create uh, different kinds of modern displays. Uh, but people said, you know, that's great. I like running in a browser. I like all these new technologies for responsive development and you know just a, a more web-focused design. But they said, you know, I don't want to be running in a browser. I need this to feel like a native application uh, running on a computer. Um, you know, maybe my computer doesn't even have a browser. Uh, and so I need it to function more like vision. So I want the best of both worlds. I want all of the flexibility and modern technology of perspective, but I want it for a desktop application like vision. And so that's where Workstation comes in. And so if I come back to this uh, perspective Workstation launcher here, you can see that now I'm not in a browser. I, I run an application on my computer. Uh, I connect it up to a gateway. I've already connected to my gateway so I can see those two projects that I was just showing you. And if I wanted to launch the same sample quick start project, I can just click on it and say open application. And this will be your first look at Perspective Workstation. As this comes up, you'll see that it doesn't open in a browser, but rather it's going to come up and take up my full screen. It goes through the same login process. It's still perspective behind the scenes, as you know. And then when it has all these resources it loaded, it displays it here. And so I have my quick start project and I can still navigate around, still do all the same things, but you can see that it's in a, a window. You know, I'm not running in a browser, it's its own thing. Um, and so just right there, uh, you already have kind of a step towards it feeling like more of a native uh, application. But with Workstation, uh, this is what we call windowed mode, meaning I could click on the top and I can drag this around. This is just a window that opened up on my OS. If I go ahead and close this, um, then within uh, my 
perspective workstation launcher, I can click on these three dots here, brings up a little menu, and I could go to manage. Um, before I do that, I do want to note, you don't have to come into this launcher every time. You could come here and create a shortcut. So there's just a specific shortcut that you click on that goes directly to a specific project, you know, or I could add this to favorites, export, delete. Um, a lot of these same features exist for the designer launcher and vision launcher and things like that as well.